for the day. How's everyone doing? Hope everyone is doing well. You miss coming live. Thank you for the donut, Talia. Happy Thursday. Thanks, Meep. I need that extra positivity today. Guys, today has been a rough week, I'm telling you. Busy day again? No, actually not too busy. I have one video I need to get done. But um, other than that, it's pretty light. I took like to yesterday as like a self-care day and I like really needed it. But honestly, I could take one more self-care day. But Soggy, thank you for subscribing. If you guys don't know, it's a members only like subscriber chat. So yeah, this where spicy tuna toys. I've been waiting for a response to an interview I had and I'm losing it today. Ah, oh, I am so sorry to hear that. It's like a weird week. Someone said that there's like a full moon, Mercury in retrograde. It's been a weird week. I'm not going to lie. Like I really do my best to stay positive. Everything works out like life lessons, all that stuff like that. But sometimes it is a lot easier said than done. And you know what? We just, we just keep going. We can control what we can control and we can't what we can't, you know? So pretty much that, but yeah. We got a new subscriber. I just missed it. Oh no. Alexis. Okay. Alexis Heidi G. Thank you for subscribing. Go live tomorrow and update. Okay, well, such a bad week. Pretty much failed my AP exam. Oh, I'm so sorry, you guys. Yeah, this week is, I don't know. You know what? It's gonna, it's gonna be better. You know, I really love May. Like May is my favorite um day. Obviously, it's my birthday, and next week is my birthday, and I'm actually really excited, and I'm actually like the happiest I've ever been on my birthday, so I'm like really grateful. It's not even like practicing gratitude. It's like, wow, I'm like actually so thankful I have my daughter here. Last last year on my birthday, I was pregnant with her, and now she's here, and like that's amazing, um, but yeah, it's just been one thing after the other, you know? But we're going to just do light makeup today. I'm not really trying to do like a full face. I did order a liquid one blush like this, but how many teeth? Uh, Paramore. I don't really listen to their music, but I like their famous songs. How many teeth does Mally have now? Almost 10 month old, have six already. Wow, that's really amazing. She has two. She is eight months and she has two teeth on her bottom row. And... 15 weeks pregnant, what is your number one recommendation for my registry? Well, that's a good question. You know what we used the most was a DACA tot. Um, and DACA tots are like love, hate. Obviously, there's people who like hate them and there's people that love them. We loved it. Um, we are always with Malibu 24 seven, always supervising, but it was just kind of nice to like have her there. Like it kind of like got you back to normal life a little bit, you know, cause you could still kind of relax and do things while she was in her tot. Um, and you know, when they're a newborn, they just lay, they don't sit up yet. So, um, yeah, I really loved the Dr. Tot. Obviously it's not advised that they sleep in it. So, um, just, you know, you know that, but yeah, I liked it. Happy almost birthday. Thank you. Sorry. Thank you for subscribing. I really appreciate it. Wait, there's some new subscribers. Let's see here. Sarah, Ali, Pinky Tinky, Michelle, Chris, thank you guys for subscribing. Appreciate it so very much. Oh man. Yeah. Oh, my makeup brushes. I'm like, where did they go? I always move them when I get glam. makeup brushes up here. I need to wash them. But until I do, Grace, thank you for subscribing. Appreciate all the love. Um, put 
this on with our little brush. I love you so much. Thanks, Grace. We've got new subscribers. Show the makeup brush holder. Okay, well. www.clark.com, the no grove. Thank you guys for being a new subscribers. Um, okay, I'll show you guys the makeup brush. It's on a little lazy Susan. And all the actual brush holders are from Amazon, and the lazy Susan was from Home Goods. Oh, it's kind of heavy. <laughs> but I love it because I always had like the ugliest makeup brushes holders. Not brushes, but my brushes are beautiful. And I was like, you know what? I need to get a makeup brush holder that's like cute, you know? Just blend, blend, blend. Yeah, I finally got a liquid blush that comes out of a wand, so it's not like. I like the NARS one, but it just doesn't, it doesn't come out smoothly. I don't really like it on my hands that much. So, nobody calls at work all day and as soon as I do, like calls back to back. Do you work from home, Spicy Training Toys, or do you like go into like an office, like call center? What do you do with all the clothes mail? We regret if you can always send them me them. We have been donating those to the Goodwill because like, I, don't, I feel like Poshmark, I don't know. I know what you mean and look like they grow out of them so quickly like but I just don't know like I don't know how to go about like you know um like lending them I guess because I know she had you know here's the thing we just did Target clothes for her and like look don't get me wrong Target clothes are expensive like I was like what the heck but we just did Target clothes for her so the stuff is nice but she definitely got they definitely got their wear out of them you know what I mean like by the time we were done with them they definitely got their wear out of them. So we were kind of like, oh, I don't know, like to give them away. But we just decided to donate them just in case, you know. Um, but yeah, maybe if there's a, another place besides. My birthday's coming up. Can you say happy birthday, Leanne? Happy birthday, Leanne. When's your birthday? My birthday is May 8th, you guys, if you didn't know. Babies are a month apart. Oh, I love that. Is your baby a Scorpio or a Leo? Because she was on the verge of both, of being both. Thank you for the seal boutique. <laughs> Is that a seal? I think so. Appreciate, appreciate, appreciate. Okay. I feel like I haven't done my makeup in so long. Let's see here. So sad we won't get to watch the reality show in the US. Oh, I love the Under the Sea. Thank you, Marina. Um, you know what? Never say never. It's definitely gonna air in um Israel first, but there was possible talks of selling it to like a Netflix or something, which I think would be really cool. I don't like and not necessarily like big or big money, and like look, we don't get any money if it sells to Netflix. But I would just like that so people could see it and watch it because we put so much work into the show. And it would be like really cool if people saw it over here too. I mean, I'm super proud of it. I'm glad Israel will get to see it. Fifi, thank you for subscribing. Appreciate it. I always appreciate your guys' support here on TikTok. You know, it's my little safe space on the internet. Yeah, it's scary me really. Yeah, teenage boys can be like scary, I guess. This. Liner shadow is so much easier, but at the same time, I still mess it up. Because <laughs> I always messed up my liner before and I still mess it up with this, but it's fine. Hi, Fiona. What's up? Thank you guys so much for being here. Oh my gosh. Ray, Ray, Raya B. Raya B. Thank you for the whale. Leah, thank you for subscribing for the first time. I love subscriber only chats because like no trolls allowed. It's actually amazing. So they're my favorite to do. I did powder underneath my eyes. I probably should do that. I never finished my top coat. <laughs> I usually just do the outside and then I'm gonna Hey, Josh. Hey, Rosie. How are you guys doing? It was raining here earlier, but I think it's cleared up, which I love. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
We are powdering the face. Oh, you know what? I never do this because like my liner, I don't want to ever mess up my wing liner. Oh. <gasps> That's why I'm like, I never really powder after because like it does get a little powdery. See my mascara. Um, do you guys have a full-time nanny to help? I'm a full-time nanny. I love it. We don't. We do everything ourselves right now. Hi, Julia. Hi, bestie. Oh, hi, Julia's bestie. Malibu Barbie is sleeping. She has been up all morning. She has been a very active girl, um, but she is sleeping right now. And yeah, she doesn't take a lot of naps anymore. I mean, she maybe takes like maybe two naps, three, two to three naps a day, really no more than three. She is like a party girl now. <laughs> she likes to be up in the action and we love it because, you know, when they're newborn, they sleep a lot. <laughs> yeah, like, okay. I mean, it's good that they sleep a lot when they're newborn because, like, as a first time mom, it can be like super overwhelming. It is super overwhelming. So it's kind of good that they're like chill as a baby. <laughs> Planning on doing anything different than how your parents raised you when you're You know what? I think all of our parents really did the best they could. I really believe that. Uh, you know, my parents worked really hard. And gave us nice things. And of course I had to do that with the mascara. Um, so I'm, you know, I'm super thankful for it, but I'm trying, you know, I'm glad to work from home. I need a new set of 2005 EP. Oh God, that would be so fun to do. I'm hoping. I'm not counting it out. You know what I mean? Jade says, thank you for her remission cameo and made her day. Let me know if you want to breathe. Yes, I definitely want updates. I love doing cameos so much and I was so happy to do that one. It was so great. I get so many like positive messages on cameo, which I'm actually going to do. I have a couple I got to do after this, but um, that one was a really special one and please give me updates. Most Virgo thing about Malibu. You know what's so funny is like, I don't really know too much about Ma about Virgos. You know what I mean? So um, I don't know what the most like Virgo thing is. But I know she's amazing and like Virgos are now my favorite people because um, she's a Virgo and she's my favorite person. So, <laughs> all right, so we are going to do, I did my makeup pretty fast today. Like I feel like I'm skipping steps or something. Okay. Let's see. Okay, so I'm actually gonna go run out and film pretty quickly today. Any life advice feeling depressed at the moment? I mean, my friends love you and your kind of news. Thank you. My best life advice is things change all the time. When things are good, they change. When they're bad, they change. Kind of, you know, go with the flows of life and trust that it all works out. One thing I know, it, it all works out. Look, I'm not saying depression cures itself. Like you, you could have, you know, people who are depressed or suffer from depression could have it the rest of their life. Like I get bouts of depression here and there. And it's how you, you know, you have to find ways to like cope with it. You know what I mean? It doesn't last forever, which is the good news. Um, we know that we get through it. So how you weather the storm is important, who you surround yourself with, if you have a support system, if you do hobbies, if you don't have a support system, you know, go do activities that have a support system, you know, um, it does pass and that's like not what you want to hear, like in the moment or something, but it does pass and life is so beautiful. The beautiful moments are, you know, are so, so beautiful and, um, yeah, it's really just figuring out ways to to get through, to weather the storm. You know what I mean? Um, I know, I know the universe wants us to always win and succeed. The universe wants us to be happy. Sometimes there's chemicals that just alter that happiness, and um, and that's okay. You know. Okay. Here. 
My hair is so blonde. Thank you for the Galaxy Raya B. I appreciate it. Thank you for being a subscriber. It's definitely from pregnancy. What is? I haven't listened to Melly Martin's new album now. Bye, Raya B. Your hair is growing so much. What do you use? Oh, someone said it's from pregnancy. That. Okay, so look. If it could be that, but I, a lot of people do get postpartum hair loss. And what I did to kind of like try to combat that, I don't know if I would have suffered that or not, but I took prenatals and I think prenatals are okay for like anyone to take. They're just over the counter vitamins and they have like iron and biotin and biotin really makes your hair grow. So I do think it's from that because my hair grew so much and I took my prenatals like all the time, like regularly. And I think that's the key is just like keeping up with it, you know? But, um, all right, guys. Okay, let's go. Hot. Oh, ow, that hurt. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I never usually highlighter. Oh, I feel like, okay, I will, I will. I just feel like highlighter doesn't do that much for me, but I will, I'll put it on. Oh my God, I can't believe I did that, that hurt. I'm a little like, like I said, this week has been a little like all over the place a little bit. I'm a little, not like bad, just, you know, uneasy, like just oh, so many decisions to make and I don't know. Okay. I think I use this Hollywood glow. Um, let's see here. But anyways, thank you guys for doing makeup with me. I'm going to go film some videos. Call it a day. But I'm gonna start coming live more because I have the time now. Um, and yeah. If you're if you're going through something right now, if you're like, ah, oh, well, that feels kind of weird. I feel like it's like the new the full moon, Mercury retrograde, all of that. So hang in there. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys soon.